All right, guys, welcome back to more Destiny 2. I really appreciate all your support. Keep it up if you want more parts quickly. Uh, right now, current level is 64. I'm saving up the glimmer. I, you know, if the cap's 25,000 still, then we'll know eventually. But uh, I'm about to continue this. I'm over the recommended power, which, you know, it's kind of rare <laughs> that I uh, am actually over that hump. I do think it's amazing how when we start the level, it like loads, but we're in the same spot we were. Detected an unusual amount of electricity being redirected into the arcology. Yep, juice like that can only mean one thing: a network of CPUs, powerful ones, maybe powerful enough to decrypt that cabal signal we intercepted. Unfortunately, we don't know where the network might be located. So, you're gonna have to snoop around, not draw too much attention. Guardian, securing this asset could turn the tide of this war with the Red Legion. Without it, I don't know what comes next. Alright, I currently swapped over to a pulse rifle. I don't know if I showed you guys this yet or not. Uh, wait, am I getting shot at? Felt like I was for a minute, didn't it? This one feels more like the messenger where it's... Some slow fire rate and it kind of jumps a little let me look at the stats one more time i can tell you just by looking at it range now the impact is really nice most time pulse rifles have a low impact at least they did in destiny one you know can i not shoot this guy i mean what's wrong with me i think fusion rifles might be one of the better specials besides it's a rocket launcher, which I haven't seen one yet. We do have our first exotic on, but that's, you know, just a chess piece. We haven't seen any exotic weapons. Now, there were the ones you got in the beta. I forgot what they're called. One was called, like, like a Gatling gun for the Titan. I can't remember exactly what it was, but each character had their own one. Hey! <laughs> Sounds like the Arcology's operating system is back online. I knew it. Keep an eye out for an OS access terminal. You can use it to pinpoint the CPU network. Not sure if I put it in the video or not, but when that dialogue was happening, my character stopped. I had just like huge sneeze just come over me. We're making pretty good progress with the story. The one thing I'm curious about, though, if it's going to be anything like the previous Destiny expansions and stuff. I would just wonder if it's going to be one of those things where you don't really get to take down, you know, the main bad guy that they've shown, the Cabal guy. Uh, if you get to take him down in the story. But you might take him down Over in the there. raid, you know? One of the access terminals we're looking for. I was weird, I was up against it, but nothing happened. The CPU network is deep in the maintenance levels. Amanda, is this what we're looking for? Bingo! That's the place. Okay, I've got the location. Let's find a way down. Nice, alright. I'm supposed to go this way. Oh no, this is gonna be bad. Because it looks like you're supposed to go through here. But you can't, so... Oh my goodness, here we go, guys. Yeah, I already knew this was about to happen. Respawning, restricted, hive coming out of the woodwork. You know what perk I miss the most is Firefly, alright? You guys don't know what it is. When you get a, a headshot on an enemy, it makes them explode and it causes a chain reaction around the enemy. So against Thrall, it's like perfect. I gotta be careful right here. You know, before I upload uh, any more videos, I actually went back and uh, I don't know what part you guys are up to now. I guess if you're seeing this, I'm not sure what the number is, but uh, pretty much just before I'm recording this one, I went back and looked at one of my 2014 I looked at the alpha gameplay, or the beta, I can't remember which one it was, but it sounds so much different, you know? I guess they have a different mic, but 
doesn't sound like a completely different person to me. I actually like the pulse rifle for both uh, both types of game types, you know, because it's it seems good. The three round burst is easy we to control. Before, on Ooh, the hold dreadnought. on, it means either doorway or treasure or chamber. The hive leaves this room to tap into their throne world dimensions. We're definitely in hive territory now. Keep radio chatter to a minimum. We don't want to draw any unnecessary attention. How convenient that the minute it runs out, that's when that knight just like shows up. I think si sidearm is actually a good alternative for the thrall as well, because you know. When they start mowing you down, it's like, you kind of need something that can shoot fast, and I think this is one of those things. Oh, no, 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 no. See, I, there's like nothing uh, came out when I shot it. Oh, I'm going to die. Oh, let my health go back up. Did they just self-detonate like that? This might be the first time I've ever done this, but my goal right now, you, you guys won't see the videos till later, but my goal is to record the entire game in one day. Like one, not one sitting, but I guess the, you know, I just want to play the full story because I want to get to where I can show you guys some more higher level stuff. Kind of like I did with a few other games. I think I did it with The Division. Uh, sure, that might be the only one that I really did that with, honestly. I like how the timing for the shield is the same as the first one. I guess instead of reloading, I could have just done the other thing. Oh, leave me alone! Man, his pulse rifle just seems like really slow, but I guess if you compare it to that scout rifle I was using, this thing is like super fast. It's a good alternative. It's like, it seems better than a scout rifle, at least right now. At least this one does. Is that everything? All right, we're supposed to go down here. Here we go. Ooh. Is there an ogre? Hey, buddy. Why am I not worried, you know? Yep, there it is. Uh-oh, hold on. I can't imagine that the sidearm's good for this. Woo! He chased me down! Alright, he pops up right here, so. He's, a, he's immune when you first see him. I don't know where to hide right here. I don't think there's any place to really hide. You know, if I had a super, that would just be perfect, alright? I guess you can stagger him a little bit. Like he's coming at me right now. There's nothing I can do. Leave me alone, leave me alone. I think I got him. Nice. If I had the fusion rifle, I would have been fine, but didn't have any more ammo. I'm just waiting for that first week of Xur, and he's gonna be selling something vicious like the Galahorn in year one. I missed out because I didn't know what strange coins were, you know? I played the PvP and I turned it off. I did the story for you guys, but that was it. That's how you saw like the memories in that first video. I uh, I didn't really start doing all like the raids and stuff until 2015, so I missed out on a lot. Oh, I really gotta shoot this. I thought I could have slid through there. Why does this feel like a strike? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. I was like, something doesn't add up here. When in doubt, shoot the wall. Alright? That's what we're gonna do going forward. Are you kidding? Guess I could use my super next time I get into a dangerous situation, but... Trying to not do that as much as I can. 
This looks like something you would see in a raid, like a big jump puzzle. Oh, I don't like this at all, guys. What in the world? Am I supposed to hop down right here? Oh my god, here we go. I don't know if I'm going the right way. What? Well, this just feels like I'm doing something, uh... Here, let me fall down. Oh, this is kind of scary. Look at this. Yeah, Firefly would light this area up. And it also makes everything, uh... Makes everything, like, illuminated. But we got these things now, so... I don't know what's going on. I'll be perfectly honest. I think, uh... This is probably the most story-driven level I've seen so far. Like, it kind of puts you in the lore of everything. Same basic premise, you know? Just kind of figuring everything out still. Apparently replaying the story missions in this game is actually worthwhile, so I, I may or may not, after I beat it, just kind of leveling up my character, but I would love to, after I beat the story, to then show you guys, like, more of it. Oh, this looks... Oh my goodness! Oh, are you kidding? That UFO thing looked kind of cool, though. I'm not gonna lie, I had, like, a really eerie feeling about that. Oh, we're here now. Nice. No, there's no way the Hive didn't hear that alarm. We got the CPU, but we stirred up the entire Hive colony, and it's a long walk to the surface. Move it, God. They're not gonna make it out of there, Commander. God. Can you make it to the center of the arcology? We should be able to send someone to pick you up from there. Holiday. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on it. I guess this is the right way. Oh yeah, it definitely is. You get experience for the, the driving them over like that. This road leads to the center of the arcology. We'll need a way out once we get there. I'm strapping in and about to take off. Oh no, what did I just do? There ASAP. Get in the driver's seat, Brad. We're good. Amanda. Sir? Fly fast. Fly safe. I do jump right in the line of fire. This feels like the end of Halo 4. I think I played that game on my channel. I can't remember. Oh, my driving. This is kind of weird, dude. Like, you don't have any kind of weapon except just driving it. Which I guess that's that's a weapon in itself, but... It's got a shield and everything, but you don't really have any way to shoot at them. Oh, is this gonna make it? Oh, I thought there was like a big hole right there. I didn't know what that was water. Got eyes on you, pal. Meet you at the end of the road. Good work, both of you. Let's get that CPU back to control and decrypt these transmissions. Things may finally be looking up for us. That was a really good level, I thought. Almighty. 
the crown jewel of the Red Legion, and life's work of their leader, Dominus Gaul. Gaul has subjugated hundreds of worlds. Those that resisted no longer exist. You see, the Almighty annihilates stars. survives Gaul's ambition. What he wants is the Traveler and its light. As for the Almighty, it's now pointed at our sun. In short, sir, the war's over and we've lost. our home under the protection of the Traveler. When our enemies attacked, we built a wall that stood for centuries. But now walls mean nothing. This enemy has taken our home, taken our light, and now they threaten our very existence. We're going all in on this almighty. How long before the fleet's combat ready? Zavala, wait. If we wait, we die. But if we attack together, we can take back our home, our light, our hope. Or we die trying. Now, I need my fire team. I need Ikora and Cade. All right, we unlocked a new world. Nice. Now we're already on the third area. New missions available. Let me hang on. Let me check this out. Is there another one here? Good to go. That's really awesome that they can do that. So, I guess uh, with that being said, guys, much love to all of you. Thank you so much for all the support, and I will catch you in the next part, guys. Take it easy. <laughs>